That's your defeat here at Winsford this afternoon, a disappointing afternoon all round, I think. Yeah, uh, first off, it's probably as good as we could have been here. Uh, and going at 1 0, and I thought we we played okay. Uh, and then second half, you know, it's just a case of calamity after calamity, and it, it's just not good enough. Uh, you know, we'll have to do something about it. You know, uh, we can't carry on as we're going, conceding goals for fun. It isn't us. Uh, and like I said, they'll be in training Monday, and we'll have to get it right. Yeah, not like that. Not like us at all that second half, really. And although we had a relatively positive first half, including a goal from from Joel uh, Collins, you know, we, I think we we were doing all right going in at the break, and then yeah, we were comfortable. To fall apart after that. Comfortable. I just said in the only thing I said at half time is don't be the one to make mistakes. Ten minutes in, and we're two one down. You know, the the first goal. I still don't know whose fault it is. We'll, we'll look at the video and see what whose fault that is. The second goal, it could have gone anywhere in the country, and it's gone in the back of the net. It's a good finish, but like I said. When it left his foot, I knew it was going in. And then, you know, the second half, we weren't a goal threat. We never looked like scoring. Uh, so, like I said, we'll, we'll hopefully bring a couple in this week. Uh, and then we've got a hell of a hard run now. We've, we've, we've some tough, tough games, you know. We've got Skem, we've got Withinshaw, we've got Avro. You know, it couldn't get any harder, you know. But that sums our season up today. Like I said, comfortable first half. Woeful second half, I think I'd use, but like I said, we'll stick together. You know, they are a good group, I still believe in them. And we're just going through one of them spells where nothing seems to be going right for us. Yeah, it's not our afternoon at all today, but um, obviously positive being Ben Fletcher back from injury. Brilliant. and had a, had, a good, had a good game and unfortunately lost Danny Rocky to injury at the end there. And I know he's struggled this afternoon with, with, with certain things, but you know, it's just obviously a big loss for the club there as well. Well, it is now with no keeper uh, going forward to Wednesday, so I'll be working hard tonight and probably tomorrow to try and bring someone in. Uh, Ben Fletcher, it's a it's a privilege to have the kid back. You know, he's 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 had a horrendous injury. He's done everything humanly possible to get himself back right. You can tell what sort of lad he is and the condition he's in today. And I thought first half, he was brilliant. Second half, you know, still as good. Uh, him and Danny Wilkes, uh, bossed the midfield. You know, and I, you know, I feel sorry for them too for us not winning today because their performance deserved a win. But uh, the rest of us, I'm not sure. Yeah, another opportunity to get it right though. At Ashton on well at home to uh, to Ashton on Wednesday. It just look, yeah, there's really some changes. Cool there's some changes. Some lads who need minutes. You know, I'm going to give them a chance. They turn up week in, week out. Uh, but like I said, we'll work on it on Monday night in training. Uh, maybe play a different different uh, formation. But you know, we've got to stick together. <laughs> you know, uh, teams do go on bad runs, and they don't become a bad side overnight. I still believe in them. Like I said, we hopefully the couple of additions I can bring in this week. You know, I might see us a little bit better, but we'll see. Cheers, Ashley. Cheers, Paul.